Well, as a committee of creditors of DHFL met today, we also understand from sources that both Oak Tree Capital and Pyramid Enterprises have up their bid. Uh, clearly, you know, this is a neck to neck race for DHFL and both sides are trying their best uh, to get the best possible bid in DHF for DHFL and win the company uh, along with its other assets, including the insurance business. Of course, Oak Tree Capital's bid is dependent on the insurance business being sold to another buyer or it can only take a limited percent of stake in it because of the FDI norms. But from what we are understanding from sources that both Oak Tree Capital and Pyramid Enterprises increased their bid by 1700 crores. Now, what are the offerings that they have made for these 1700 crores? Well, Oak Tree Capital is offering 1700 crores as additional interest payment to financial creditors. While DHFL, we understand, has offered additional 1,000 crores as interest payment to financial creditors. The balance 700, though, is coming from uh, Pyramal Enterprises increasing its amount or offer for DHFL's insurance business. So earlier, Pyramal Enterprises was offering 300 crores for the insurance business. And now we understand it has been increased to 1,000 crores. So that is where the additional 700 crore amount is coming. What we also know is that Pyramid Enterprises increased the amounts on 22nd of December uh, and this was as part of the revised plan that they submitted uh, taking into account all the confusions that were the clarifications that were there on the part of the lenders. But Oak Tree Capital has submitted this revised bid only today. Uh, it's very likely that it has been done because Pyramid Enterprises increased their bid as well. And before this meeting as well, if you remember, we had reported that both sides had written letters uh, Pramil Group Chairman Ajay Pramil himself had written to the DHFL Administrator and the letter was marked to RBI Governor, LIC Chairman, IRDI Chairman, SBI Chairman as well. This letter basically was to say that Pyramid Enterprises, uh, the bid by Pyramid Enterprises is the best bid uh, when it comes to value maximization. He had also said that Oak Tree Capital's bid does not meet uh, the parameters of feasibility, viability and also is not implementable because Oak Tree Capital is a foreign player and the insurance business sale will be key to getting the rest of the company as well. Additionally, we also know that uh, Pyramid Enterprises had said that uh, if, we, if the 1,500 crore escrow amount that has been put in by Oak Tree Capital in their plan is adjusted, in that case, the plan by Pyramid Enterprises is higher by 2,500 crores. Now, in retaliation to that, uh, Oak Tree Capital had written to the Committee of Creditors. Now, what they have said is that they have been a, the, suspect, uh, the subject of a sustained campaign to undermine their bid. And very importantly, any suggestion that Oak Tree Capital's bid is uh, conditional is incorrect and designed to mislead. Oak Tree Capital has also said that they would not have been invited to bid in the first place if their bid was not implementable because they are a foreign player. They have also raised concerns about uh, the image of India in terms of getting a foreign player to participate in the bidding process for such IBC processes. They have said that foreign investors do not expect to be invited and then be discriminated against because they are not a domestic player. And additionally, they have said that the resolution process has been opaque with multiple shifting parameters, clarifications were not provided, multiple rounds of bidding happened and they have also reminded the committee of creditors that Oak Tree Capital has been the only company that has bid for the entire company starting from the first round of bidding itself. So this is what we are picking up. Of course, further details on what transpired in the COC meeting is awaited. But at this point, we know that both the parties have increased their bid and the competition, of course, is neck to neck.